Uh, we're at Lambeth College. We've been invited to talk to young people about their future, about inspiring them for the future, about helping them to think about what they need to be thinking about in the careers world. It's, been, it's actually been really, really good. So um, we've gone round to different groups. There's been two of us from employers, and then it's been a, like a real open forum. So it's been some really practical questions in terms of what these um, students can do to best prepare themselves for the world of work. Given the experiences of when we were looking for work as well, what we learnt and some of the mistakes we made so they can benefit from the mistakes as well as the advances. What we've been able to do is use our contacts to bring a wide range of businesses uh, and volunteers today. I think we had over 80 volunteers uh, from about 20 22 businesses. What's most important is that they have a perspective from an outside person. Somebody that can basically say to them, this is what you need to do in order to achieve your goals. Giving them that sense that, yeah, I can do it, it's possible. It gave a bigger insight to the world of work. Altogether it was really fun because it was all interactive. This afternoon we're going to be doing role plays on interviews and critiquing those interviews and I think it's very important to get feedback. It'll be a real interview and we will be asking them a host of questions about themselves, where they want to be in five years, how they view their strengths and weaknesses. Many of these young people would never have interviewed, had an interview before and they were quite nervous uh, but we've got a lot of confident young people and we've got a young people who've grown in confidence as a result of the programme. Uh, this afternoon I've had an interview inside. Yeah, they helped me with my interview techniques. This is a bit of a special thing because people our age, we don't really get these type of chances to do this. During the process of our interview, they were able to give us back feedback. They were told us what we need to work on. They were told us, they were told us what went well. So we're really trying to simulate a real interview for them so that when they do have an interview, they'll understand how that process works. Qualifications matter. And so whenever the opportunity at school was provided to get a qualification, I always made sure I take that one plus another one as well. Think about yourself as, as a commodity that you want to improve, that you want a position in life so that you can take the opportunities that will, will come your way. Anything that you want to achieve in life that is about reaching the pinnacle of your career takes time and it takes patience. Don't expect it to simply happen overnight. I found it really interesting. You're talking to someone that's had that experience, has been there and done it. I'm gonna take away um, that believe in yourself, you can do anything. So it's just given me an insight of how I need to act and how I need to present myself for the future. Yeah, it has given me more confidence that I, than I had before. It's basically encouraging people to work more so that they can become successful in future and how never give up in life in general. The EIA program, I think in terms of getting people ready, and that's really what's about getting them ready to transition um, into that real world, that world of work is what E and I and Derek and the team does and I think it's a great thing they do it. I think the way that it's been organised has been, actually it's been fantastic, it's been really practical rather than us just standing up and preaching um, at the students which you know they're going to get bored with. Um, it's been very very interactive. So this is the second year that EIA have come along to help our students and it's been a very successful event, very well run by the facilitators and we want to continue this relationship because it means that we can work with entrepreneurs and inspire our students. Programs like this help people to, and inspire them to go further into their education and see what they can do in order for themselves to go to college, uni and get a job. It's blown me away um, and if you get a taste of this it will blow you away too. Keep up the great work. So if I had access to a programme like this much earlier on, I think I'd have been more proactive rather than reactive. So I, I love the, the idea and the ideals. They're a lot more enthusiastic. Um, they're a, a lot more assured of their future, which is really what we wanted to happen out of this. 
professionals make it more engaging and they also give their perspectives so rather than just teaching us what the curriculum they give us outside the curriculum of what they've learned from themselves. It's about inspiring futures. It's about planting those seeds that hopefully will take some of these young people to a place of success. I think all schools should get involved in this amazing program. Having people come along and inspire your students is something that money cannot buy. It's very well run, it's structured accordingly and it provides the children for a better start for their futures.